Hello, welcome to Waypoint Survival. Today, I want to talk to you about the proper way to lay in a military blanket. Stay tuned. Wool blankets are just an excellent survival tool, as is all wool clothing. As many of you already know, wool maintains its ability to keep your heat in uh, even if it's soaking wet. As a matter of fact, studies say that 100% wool will keep in 80% of your body heat when it's soaking wet. And because of the way the fibers are made, it has to be at least 50% wet before it starts to feel wet. Now, of course, it'll get very heavy and all that, but you can actually make a shelter out of this. You can make a hammock. There's all kinds of wonderful things you can do with a wool blanket. But generally speaking, we use a wool blanket to sleep in. And this wool blanket, like most U.S. military surplus blankets or other surplus blankets from around the world, they seem a little small. And this one is about 80 inches long and about 64 inches wide. So that's less than seven feet tall or long and just a little bit over five, not even five and a half, it's five and a third feet wide. So for someone my size, it's pretty hard to roll up in this. But I want to show you the right way to do it. So most of the time when we think of a blanket, we think of it in terms of laying it out something like this. We get in it and we lay down and then we pull it over top. The problem is, while this works, generally speaking, there's not a lot of overlap. And it's just really hard when you get up around your shoulders. There's almost no room at all and you have this gap right here in the middle that even when you pull it tight, it's, there's just not a lot of blanket. So it's very uncomfortable and you stay kind of cold, uh, especially if uh, you know, you're trying to wrap up or roll up in it. You know, there's a lot of ways you can do it, but you're still dealing with this gap right here. So the proper way to lay in a blanket of this shape and dimension is to lay in it diagonally. And what you do then is you take this bottom flap here, this bottom corner, and you pull it over your feet like this. Then you take this side and you flip it over. Now, if you have your large blanket pins that I showed you in the uh, Modern Day Possibles kit, and I'll put a link to it up here, what you do is you take your first pin and you pin this flap here together. So we pin this just right in this area here. Pin those two together like that. Then we take the other flap, we pull it over this way. And then we pin this second flap down over here like this. All right, so now we have the bottom pinned and what we've effectively made is a foot box uh, where we can't just kick it apart, we can roll around and our feet aren't gonna get cold. Then, you lay down, you take this flap, you go over this way, and the other corner, you bring it around, and now we have plenty of room to lay. We're totally covered up in the wool blanket, and uh, there's enough room here for the head, so we can lay down without being on the ground, and uh, we can roll around as much as we wish, and uh, still stay nice and warm. And works quite well. And that's how you lay properly in a wool blanket. This is James Bender for Waypoint Survival. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Make sure and check out the links in the description box below. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. We'd really appreciate it. And when you do subscribe, make sure and press that bell button to stay notified of all of our upcoming videos. And we'll talk to you next time.